in terms of whether or not I have personally experienced racism, the answer is yes. Over the years, from when I was a kid up until even now as an adult, I've definitely experienced racism. A lot of it does come in the form of microaggressions. And because I am relatively light skinned, maybe like I'm very tan right now in the summer, but usually I'm a lot lighter than I am. I don't actually get read as being South Asian to a lot of people, or I'm what people I guess calls ethnically ambiguous. So no one's really quite sure what I am. So I get that question a lot like, what are you? As if I'm like some sort of mystical being or alien, who knows what people think they're getting at when they're asking that question. It's so weird to ask someone like, what are you? Um, but when people do find out that I'm South Asian, so one of the earliest memories of this I remember is probably in like the sixth or seventh grade. There was one kid that found out and he immediately reverted to just doing Apu's voice and stereotype and asked me questions like, do your parents work at Quickie Mart? Things like that. So that was, you know, when I was a kid and then going through school, I would get called a coconut by other South Asian kids because they said that I was brown on the outside and white on the inside, which is also kind of a strange thing because I didn't feel like I really connected with like the South Asian kids, but I also didn't connect with the kids that weren't South Asian because I was kind of like in between both. And I think that's the case for a lot of millennial South Asian kids that grew up here in the Lower Mainland, from my understanding and talking to the other people of their, their experiences. And then as an adult, I would often get mistaken for being Middle Eastern, so I'd get like Islamophobia, even though I'm not Muslim or Middle Eastern. So I was called a terrorist once on Main Street by some random person walking by, which was like, that's, I'm not even Middle Eastern, but also, you know, that is what it is. Um, but I've never experienced it like super aggressively to the extent that I think a lot of people have. I've witnessed people on the street get attacked for wearing turbans. And those are people that, you know, are from the same country that uh, my family originates from. And I've never had it as bad. And a lot of that has to do with because my like light skin privilege that I do have, I think. I think that confuses a lot of people or makes them, makes me less of like a target at like very overt racism, I think.